what I did and I want to show you guys that that's not what you need to do you just need to get back on track with where you were so drinking a lot of water and making coffee right now I don't have to work today so we'll be cooking most meals here but um, yeah stay tuned I'm um, just going to take you along with my day, show you what I'm eating, show you guys that you don't need to restrict yourself after the holidays or after any period of time where you eat a little bit more than usual or a little bit more unhealthy foods than normal. Just get back into your routine, eat your fruits and veggies, and yeah, let's get into it. You already know the drill. We're making protein coffee. I'm using the first form level one German chocolate cake. Um, this is the first, well I've had it before, but this is my first container of this and I really like it. Um, I think I like the cinnamon cookie batter a little bit better, but this is still really good. Also, I have a new obsession. This is my French press. I asked for this for Christmas and I absolutely love it. Um, I was just getting tired of my Keurig. And I didn't use K-cups anyway, I used like the reusable cups, so I thought might as well just like get something that I use grounds for. So I'm still figuring it out. The, the taste of the coffee in a French press is so strong, so I'm still trying to figure out the balance between like water and grounds to kind of like make it a little bit medi more mediocre. I like coffee, but I don't like super, super strong coffee. And I have a medium roast, and this cup's not gonna be big enough. Today I'm probably just gonna have one cup of coffee, so I did a full scoop of the protein, but if I have two, then I do like half and half. Um, but I always make sure to have a full scoop every day just to help me get my protein in. And which is really important in your diet to have enough protein, because it keeps you full for longer, helps your muscles, all that fun stuff. I'm just gonna go drink this and read a little bit. I just filled up my hydro drugs, so I got my water, and I don't think I can carry it all. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yeah. Cheers. <clears throat> Breakfast time. I think I'm gonna make some pancakes. I haven't had pancakes in a while. And I have a different Kodiak Cakes box. It's the buttermilk and honey. It's the only thing they had at the store. I usually just get the, I don't know, like the regular one. But trying this out today. Ooh. I'm gonna put some chocolate chips in them. Cause well, why not? And yeah, um, don't skip breakfast. Because A, breakfast is the best meal of the day. Don't argue with me, it is. Um, and also just don't skip any meals like meals are important it's important to eat throughout the day it doesn't matter if you ate a lot yesterday if you're gonna eat a lot tomorrow oh 
my god, my legs are so sore. Um, you just need to eat. You need to eat every meal. Just do it. Listen to your hunger cues. Eat what you crave, what you want. Just freaking eat. <laughs> and ready and stuff for the day but also Mallory and I are gonna go take some pictures today for my website because we're doing a little update on that um, but just reminding you guys to drink your water this is my second one of the day try to drink two a day um, I'm actually very good about drinking water which I'm lucky because I know a lot of people struggle with it but um, I usually can drink more than two, usually like two and a half to three of these a day, um, but drink your water, gotta hydrate. But yeah, we're gonna go take some pictures. I'm probably gonna eat lunch after just because I'm not super hungry yet. Um, still full for my breakfast, but there are some exciting things happening for me and for Grace P. Fit. Um, We've got some stuff coming up in the new year. We got a little website redesign going on right now. Some things are coming out with that. Um, I was expecting it all to happen a little bit sooner. However, my laptop recently broke, um, like completely, and I need a new one. So we are on a little bit of a hold right now. I'm using Ethan's laptop for the time being, but all of my data is on a flash drive right now um, and I'm working on getting a new computer so that I can get everything transferred over onto that and hopefully have my website launched by the new year and then there should be a couple things to follow after that so stay tuned definitely um, I'm really excited to get some good pics today this is my outfit this uh, wearing the Gymshark uh, flex high waisted and then just this pullover from Adidas and I have a couple changes but um, it's freezing out it is 27 degrees it snowed heavily yesterday so hopefully we can get some good pics and I'm not like freezing in them but I just have a couple ideas of where I want to go what I want to do it should be like pretty fast. I just need some updated stuff for my brand, my business, my website. I'm so excited. Thank you guys for coming along on this journey with me and for supporting me through everything and definitely keep your eye out for some new stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna keep drinking some more water. We're gonna head out and then I'll be back to cook lunch. So. <laughs> We haven't left it and I got a little bit hungry. So I'm having a rum ball, don't judge me. I have so many leftover Christmas treats and stuff, so. I can't go to Lay's. 
I changed because I got makeup on my white Adidas. Kind of mad. Um, I never wear makeup, so I never have that problem, but of course. Now I got that, but I do laundry anyway. I'm going to wear it with a different pair of leggings. It's just like right on the collar. And then I'm going to wash it, but Mal should be here soon. And then we'll go, but I just thought I'd tell you that I had a rum ball. And it was delicious. Okay, so we're back from the shoot, and if you couldn't hear that, I'm sorry. I'm doing laundry. Um, but I'm starving, and that was really fun, and I love Mallory. I'm so grateful for her. She just took some pics of me today, which was awesome. So we are making tortilla pizza. Delish. Um, so I've been making these a lot recently. I absolutely love them. I have, this is my last one, which is sad. This extreme wellness wrap. And then I do, I'm probably going to cut up like a potato and air fry it too. For the sandwiches, Cause like this isn't enough calories, but garlic. Um, I love garlic and I love garlic on my pizzas. Like as a base before the sauce, so. Spread that around on there, just gives it extra flavor, makes it super yummy. I've always done this with pizzas. I absolutely love making homemade pizzas. Like I love, like when I was living at home, we would do like homemade pizza nights every once in a while. We'd get those like personal crusts and all make our own pizzas. And Ethan and I have done that a couple times and it's just fun. And then I do some sauce. vegan cheese. I have um, some like mozzarella in here. I know it like might look gross but it tastes pretty good and I have like two different types of mozzarella. One's like an almond based and then this one's a cashew based so it like melts a little bit better and it's more like your traditional like mozzarella that you would put on a pizza so it's super good. Right, that should be good for cheese. And then today I'm going to add some Kalamata olives to give it a little Mediterranean vibe. Um, I wish I had spinach. I freaking love olives. I love green olives. I love Kalamata olives. I love black olives. Just I'm so freaking good. These are awesome. I use them with like hummus for like dips. I like add them on top of my hummus and have it with crackers and my pizza. I've made like a couple like Mediterranean like rice bowls. Delicious. Yes, superb. So yummy. Alright, so that was that. Here's this. I'm gonna throw it in. Have another olive because you know. And then I think I'm gonna cut up a potato and throw in the air fryer too. And then a little bit of ketchup. 
for the potatoes. Yum. Hope you guys are having a great day. I think I'm going to Ethan's tonight, so we're gonna have dinner there. I don't know what we're having, um, but that should be interesting. Usually we have like spaghetti or something, which I'm not mad about. I love spaghetti, but yeah, it's been so nice to just have the day to cook all my meals for me. Side note, I don't have a pizza cutter, so I like have to use my like knife, but it never like cuts it all the way. I'm gonna have to recut this pizza. But I'm gonna eat this and then I'll see you guys when I'm hungry again. Hello. I have been laying in my bed editing pictures ever since. I talked to you guys last when I was having lunch, but I just really want to get them edited and uploaded it. Uploaded it. Did. Wow. Wow. <laughs> uploaded so that I can put them on my website because it is basically done. I'm just waiting for those pictures, which is really exciting, but I just made myself a snack, so I'm just gonna get back into bed here, you know? Isn't it just the best when it's like, right now it's literally like three o'clock and you just get to like crawl into your comfy bed. I feel like three o'clock is like that time when like everybody's just like slumped. So here's my snack. So I have vegan cheese, vegan pepperonis, nut thins, olives, roasted red pepper hummus, and these like garlic thyme crackers. So yeah, I'm gonna snack on this, gonna keep editing. Um, and then the next time I see you, I'll probably be at Ethan's for, here's the sun. Of course it comes out now. It hasn't been out all day. Anyway, I'll probably be at Ethan's next time I see you, so stay tuned for whatever the heck we're gonna have for dinner there. Because how did they like, that scares me.
downstairs in the local apartments where I get to keep my steroids. You heard it here first, folks. Garrett takes steroids. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what word? Well, what? all right. No, you're not listening. What? You know how I knew Connor was leaving me to go play Connor? Good morning. I am horrible. I didn't finish off this video last night. Um, but basically, everything I showed you, we did cauliflower wings and sweet potato. Puffs, they were called <laughs> for dinner, and then I had like a little piece of fudge for dessert. But that's everything, and I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I just wanted to show you that you don't need to restrict after the holidays, and you can just go back to your normal way of eating, eating um, what your body craves and what you crave. Just feeling your body and listening to your hunger cues. So make sure that you don't restrict yourself after this holiday season and just give your body a little extra love. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you did. And um, I'll see you next week.